transitioning from MJ's catch and shoot game, we'll now look at his one dribble pull ups. MJ did several things well that I think you can quickly and easily adopt and adapt to your own game. The first concept you can apply to your own game is attacking open space. Yes, Jordan took and made contested shots, but watch how he also did a great job of using one dribble to get to open space for a better shot. The second thing Jordan did phenomenally is maintaining his balance while shooting one dribble pull-ups. It can be more difficult to maintain balance when shooting off the dribble, so watch how MJ kept his center of mass low to the ground for better balance by keeping his knees bent and butt down. The last thing Jordan did great in his one dribble pull-ups was having a high release point. The importance of this is twofold. First, a high release allows you to get your shots off over a defender. The second reason a high release point is important is because it improves accuracy. The closer your shot release is to the plane or line of the basket, the greater the margin of error is, because it essentially increases the size of the hoop on the other end of the parabola. Make sure to like the video and tag someone you think would enjoy this. And check in tomorrow as we go over the details of Jordan's fadeaways.